Ugh, my friends, we have made it to Friday. My name is Corey V, and today we're going to be testing out some relaxing eye masks for this edition of Face Mask Friday. So I have here a self-heating aromatherapy eye mask from the brand Juve Naturals, or Juve Naturals. It is supposed to be anti-dark circles, fine lines, crow's feet, and tired eyes, and it stays warm for up to 30 minutes. You get one mask inside. I have this one, which is lavender, and I also have one that is not aromatherapy. It is just unscented. So if you are scent sensitive, they have an option for you. These masks retail for $20 and you get a set of six masks, although right now they're on sale for $15. I don't know how long that sale will last. And the website says, once the mask is removed from its pouch and placed around your eyes, you will be enveloped, enveloped? You will be enveloped with soothing, warm, and comfort for up to 30 minutes. And according to the website, you can get these masks in person at a lot of different places. Apparently like CVS, Meyers, May Mayer, Ricky's, Sally's, Urban Outfitters, Walmart, and Amazon. And Juve Naturals was actually kind enough to send me a package of both the scented and the unscented. However, this review is not sponsored and my link will be in an Amazon affiliate link, but it's completely unrelated to this brand. It is strictly from my point of view. But I think today it's late at night on a Friday. I want to get a really good restful sleep tonight. So I'm going to try the lavender scented mask. These, they say, tear the pouch from the top and unzip to remove the eye mask. After removing the eye mask, it will begin to self-heat. Loop the mask around your ears and enjoy the warmth combined with the rejuvenating aroma. And again, they say it will relieve your tired eyes, it will reduce wrinkles and crow feet, vanish dark circles, beat insomnia and jet lag, and then they explain why you might want a lavender scent, basically for relaxation. The product was designed in New York City, but manufactured in China. They say it heats up to 41 degrees Celsius and that it will remain warm for up to 30 minutes. The ingredients are quite simple, as you can see and they do have some warnings. Let me go ahead and open it up and we will take a look and smell and see what the product is like. So here's what it looks like. It just says relax on it. Doesn't really smell like anything quite yet, but I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna be blind here and take off my glasses and just throw it on. And then I will check back with you in 10 minutes. All right, here we go. All right, guys, I am back. It has been a full 30 minutes. I still got a bit of heat left, um, but overall, what can I say? It felt amazing. It is so nice if you're like me and you're constantly on your computer. I'm on my computer for work. I'm on my computer for my leisure time. I'm on my computer for my hobbies. I'm just like always on my computer or my cell phone. My eyes are always bleeding pain. That might be an exaggeration, but my eyes are always <laughs> strained and sore, and the stuff felt amazing. I have tried out some other self-heating masks. Um, one that I can get here in Superstore, it's like an Asian brand, and then another one we bought off of Amazon that is reusable and USB powered. You can check those reviews out here. But overall, I have to say I really, really did like this mask. It warmed up very nicely. It smells amazing. I love that they have a non-scented option so people like my mom could use it because she's super sensitive to scent. I think it looks a little bit more stylish than some of the other ones we've tried. It looks, looks a little bit less like a menstrual pad and more like a spa experience. Not that that really matters. Uh, if you're American, these masks work out to about $3.30 a piece. So I would say that is a decent price. They are pretty pricey for what they are, but I feel like the ones that I get at Superstore are no cheaper than that one, so I can't really knock it for price unless you go with something like the USB one where you're constantly reusing that one. But overall, I think this is a very nice product. I think it's a great quality. It is an amazing feeling. If you have never tried one of these self-heating masks, I strongly strongly recommend you give it a go. I do kind of doubt that it really does too much for wrinkles, crow feet, 
and your dark circles, I think those are just more genetic than anything else. Um, but I do think they're great for insomnia and jet lag, and they just feel so amazing on your tired eyes. The way they kind of heat up against your eyes, especially if you put eye drops in them beforehand, it really feels like a moist kind of sweaty sweat lodge for your eyeballs in the best possible way. It just feels so, so, so nice. So again, I would highly, highly, highly recommend you give this brand or any other type of self-heating masks a go. Um, they're very simple. If you're kind of freaked out by the concept, they're very similar to the hand and feet warmers that you can find a lot of places here in Canada in winter and I'm sure other cold climates around the world that you like stick in your boots or your gloves to help keep your extremities warmed. Same kind of principle, just these go on your eyes. So my only real big complaint is just the price and the fact that they're kind of a one-time use product. But overall, I still love these. I would still ration these out for days where your eyes just can't take it anymore. Even just taking some to work and using them at the office for a quick break or over lunch. Ugh, so good, you guys. Overall, I'm gonna give these Juve Naturals Self-Heating Steam Therapy Eye Masks a five out of five. You, you gotta try one. Again, if not this one, then a different brand. Just give your eyes a break, they deserve it. Anyway guys, that's all for this week's Face Mask Friday. A little bit different, I know, but I love trying these weird products. If you have any other recommendations for kind of weird face masks, do leave a comment down below. Thanks again to my patrons who helped make these videos possible. Thank you to Juve Naturals for sending me this product to try. Again, not sponsored, not affiliated with the company but they were kind enough to send them to me. And with that, I will see you all in my next beauty video. Bye for now.